Ah, oh, man. So, today, I wanted to talk about... No, let's not do that. Hey, 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 I'm so sorry, like, I missed yesterday. <laughs> um, brings me on to today's point. I want to talk about excuses. Oh, just so easy, isn't it, to make an excuse? Oh, I was just too busy, or I was just doing this, or I was just doing that. I didn't have time to do it. Um, genuinely, I was just busy with work. I had a couple of client meetings. I got to took some more work on, and, you know... Never going to turn down work in a pandemic, are you? So my own vlog had to sort of take a back seat. Um, so, yeah, sorry, everyone. I've been away for a couple of days and I've not managed to stick to my daily vlogging. However, I'm not going to make any excuses. I hold my hands up. I didn't stick to what I said I'd do. However, that doesn't mean I'm going to stop. Just because I've had a couple of ba bad busy days doesn't mean I'm going to stop doing it. It's the same with dieting and exercise, isn't it? It's so easy to just... Oh, I'll have a takeaway one night and then have something else to eat the next day or oh, I'll just stick with it. It's like smoking used to be, isn't it? Oh, I'll quit in the morning. I'll just have one. Just have oh, my last fag and then you'll buy a packet and you'll only have one a day. I'll only have one a day, but you'll smoke 10 anyway. I remember when I was a smoker, I used that excuse about 100 times. I think, you know, six years no smoking. You know, it's, it's you know, wow, what a difference. But... You know, excuses are there to be made, and I suppose it's how you battle through them that, that makes it count. We're at that point now, in January, where everybody stops what they said they would do. We're at that point where everyone's excuses are coming out of the bag. Oh, well, I'm, I'm not, I had a shit day at work, or oh, I've had a shit week, or oh, it's been, you know, homeschooling, you know, so I said I'd be dry for January, but now we're in lockdown, I'm not going to, you know, stick to your guns, stick to what you said you'd do. Um, you know, there's a, there's a saying that says, um, I'm going to find it, one sec. But there's a saying by a guy called Inky Johnson about commitment, and it says commitment is staying true to what you said you were going to do way after the mood you said it in has left. And what a saying that is. I mean, that's sticking to what you said you'd do, even if you don't feel like doing it. That's commitment. And now everyone's at that point of their, their January... You know, the new new year, new me. Like, just like I have been, I'm going to blog every day. I'm going to blog every day, and then things come up, and you make excuses you don't do. But it's how you get back onto it that counts. So don't fall off the wagon. If you said you're going to do something, get to it. And uh, well, I'm going to make some more videos. Yes, I made a couple. I didn't like them. I didn't put the time and effort into them, so I stopped them. And I'll redo them when I've got the time to make them better. Um, I hope everyone's doing well. I hope you're all staying strong. Love you all lots. See you later.